Well, I had a foot injury several years ago, and it was plantar fasciitis. And if you've ever had that, you know it feels like you're stepping on a tack all the time. I'm an athlete by nature, a triathlete as a matter of fact, and was searching for a cure and tried literally every modality you can imagine from physical therapy to sleeping in a boot. And before surgery, finally learned about Regenix as a surgical alternative and decided I would give it a try. So the typical patient that comes to see us here at Regenix are, are those folks that are looking for a different way, an alternative to, to surgery. They're looking for ways to uh, allow them to continue to do the things that they love and want to do without invasive surgeries and pain medications um, that they don't want to take. It took about two to three months before I was really able to get back up and running again, meaning running, running. But after that, I was pain free and I didn't have to go through a surgery, which was the beautiful thing about this. If I would have had to have a fascial release, they told me I would have not been running for more than a year. So clearly this was a much better alternative for me. Regenix is also the only company that I could find that is FDA compliant, meaning no other company can advertise that that says they are following the FDA rules as are regulated by stem cells and blood platelet injections. My dad avoided meniscus surgery on his knee. Interestingly enough, I will tell you that before we learned about Regenix, he had his other knee scoped and cleaned up as they call it. He today will tell you that the knee that he had scoped feels worse than it did before, and the knee that he had his Regenix procedure on, actually he's pain free in. So what that tells me is that there are other people out there who have injuries or had injuries very similar to what I have, and they too could benefit from this procedure, whether it's people my age, people who are younger, or people who are older than what I am.